As the Harlan Independent School District gathers for its 106 year reunion this weekend, a group within the school system celebrates 50 years of music. They have sung at a presidential inauguration and around the world, but they told WIMT's Caleb No, it's about much more than just the music. From Harlan to Washington, D.C. and around the world. People constantly tell me they think it's wonderful how many places uh, I took the choir. Uh, no, I, what's even more wonderful is all the places they took me. A group that has filled the air with music for 50 years. Literally, uh, we sang from one end of the country to the other. David Davies founded the Harlan Boys Choir in 1965. He says he never imagined at the time that some of the students would be gathering now and the choir would still be going strong. Had absolutely no idea, no experience or background in that area, so uh, I had not an inkling of a notion. But some of the first members of the boys choir and others from throughout the last half century will be making a trip to Harlan this weekend. This auditorium will be fit with music. Songs that cross cultures from a group that spans generations. We're brothers, and one of our songs is Brothers Forever, and uh, that we sing. And uh, we've seen them come and go, we've seen them die, but they're still a part of us, even if they're not here, they're still a part of us. 50 years of voices coming together to celebrate, remember, and of course, sing. In Harlan County, Caleb No, WYMT Mountain News. I always enjoy hearing them sing. The Boys Choir will hold a concert at 3 o'clock Saturday at the Harlem Baptist Church.